I want to do, uh, speaking of the internet, I want to do an update on the story we covered last week about the 14-year-old boy in Texas who, uh, they said, invented a clock. <laughs> okay, a little update on this. Uh, they, his parents took him out of school, uh, and he's just doing TV now, and he's on, like, a, a tour. And look, I, I'm not anti this kid. I hope this kid has a wonderful life and does great things. But the li mostly liberals, you'll like this, who have glommed on to him as a mascot, are ninnies mm -hmm. uh, because somebody showed that he did not invent anything. Show the tape of somebody that this was on the internet. It took 20 seconds for this somebody to do what this kid did. He didn't invent a clock. He took the guts out of a clock radio that he bought in the store and put it in a pencil box. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay? This, this is like pouring Cheerios into a bowl and saying you invented cereal. This, <laughs> well, and then made it look like a bomb. <laughs> and made it look like a bomb. Yeah. Nobody's look, saying the kid's Thomas Edison, but did he deserve to be arrested for, for that's making That's not this the point. That's not what we did that last week. That's okay. not the point. Uh, no, sorry, he, didn't, I wouldn't he didn't deserve I wouldn't to be hear. didn't deserve to be arrested. Okay. But they did absolutely do the right thing. Thinking that it could be a bomb. I thought we had zero tolerance for no safety in the Except, school. If you can Except. get expelled for drawing a picture of a gun, I think you can be detained well, for so bringing cool. something that looks like a bomb to school. But it didn't look like a bomb. It looked like a clock. It what? looked exactly what? like a no, bomb. Have you not no, seen no, Die Hard no, movies? That no, looks exactly what? like a bomb. No, here's the thing about bombs, right? They have the little timer that's the clock that's part, what? and then those wires that come out. They're attached to fissile material that explodes. Okay. That was the, mi that was the missing element in this bomb. Excuse me, Ron. The thing that blows up. <laughs> Nothing I, blew up. I don't notice no. all that when I see that hunk when of you, metal there. When you see a clock? You know what, Ron? Try to take that through airport security yeah. tomorrow and I see if they could. take it. No, I think oh, you could. It's you a could. clock. It's, it's a clock. It's a clock only because we were told it was a clock. It's and by the clock. way, it's only the guts of a clock. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Show the tape from Good Morning America. Here he is this week on Good Morning America. Do you have something with you? Can we see it? It's the motherboard of the entire media player. Have you always been fascinated with things like that and doing things like that, Ahmed? This isn't my first invention and it won't be my last invention. It's not an invention. <laughs> Again, he took the back out of something. And let me just say, Google invited him to their science fair where a 15-year-old invented an automated method for finding and characterizing gravitationally lensed quasars. Yeah. And a 16-year-old invented an inexpensive test for the Ebola virus. Well, he's only 14. He's so. only 14. <laughs> Next year. I made a bong out of an apple. <laughs> <laughs>